Alright, 504 Spartan here, and this is going to be a Yu-Gi-Oh! video. I'm going to talk a little bit about Airsoft and a little bit about uh, 40k. First of all, I'm 40k. Grey Knights are out, I don't run Grey Knights. Well, Sp Space Wolves are out, I don't run Space Wolves. So, yeah, I have really not much to talk about there. Uh, my latest video was my entire guard army that was painted. Uh, if you'd like to see that, please go check it out. I'll be in the link description below. <clears throat> For Airsoft, um, there's still stuff that I still have to show and uh, review. For example, I just got myself a M93 Rafika. I have to review that and my, my take on it, so yeah. But aside from that, now this is the Yu-Gi-Oh! section. This is for my Yu-Gi-Oh! subscribers. Um, this is a deck that I've been working on recently. This is the Quasar Synchro deck for this entire format. However, this is my take on it. And another thing, I do not have Quasar. I know. I know. Kill me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> right now I'm using a proxy or the card that uh, I'm proxying. I could use it anyways instead of Quasar, but it's no Quasar, so no shooting Quasar Dragon. So, I'm going to wait until Legendary Collection 5Ds to come out and get it myself, so yeah. So, let's start with the main deck, shall we? So, we have three Junk Synchrons. Uh, junk Synchron is very good tuner. Uh, level 3 tuner brings stuff back from the grave. Uh, very versatile, and this is the main thing that I could use. Then you have three quick draws, three quick draw synchron. Uh, once again, main engine. This is the main engine of the deck, so you run three quick draws, three junk synchrons so far. Three level eaters, because you're gonna need for the if you want to summon the quasar in one turn, you're gonna need this these three cards in your hand. You have that, you have to turn one quasar. So yeah, <clears throat> two synchron explorers. Uh, why not three? Clocks a hand, and it's not a tuner, so there's no way how to search it. The only other way how to special summon it, aside from like uh, using spells and traps, using uh, what's his name, using road warrior, but you don't want to do that. So yeah, so two is two is good enough. Um, two tuning wear. Excellent draw, uh, draw card. You could, if you already have stuff like in your grave and you don't need uh, to one for one a spore, you could go for the tuning wear, and then that that way you could play around with this as your non-tuner. It also increases its level by one if you use it uh, to synchro summon, and the best thing you get to draw a card. So, yeah, <clears throat> one doppel warrior, doppel warrior is great. I think at one is pretty good because if you have too uh, too many of them, like two or three, uh, it's not gonna clog the hand. It's probably gonna clog the field whenever you synchro summon. And if you have too many monsters in your field and you don't have the space for the two of them, uh, the two two tokens, you're not gonna get the two tokens. Same thing with Dandy. So yeah, one Valor, Valor level one tuner, and also he is he negates effects. So if you if you think your opponent's gonna play something well, just Valor him. Just say, you know what, Valor. Yeah. <clears throat> One unknown synchron for the for the quasar uh, the first turn quasar, you're gonna need this in the deck. Uh, running two, I don't think it's right. Uh, because one of, you just needed to get it out. So yeah. One debris dragon, debris dragon. Uh, bring back dandy or bring back something weak synchro for uh, black rose blow up the field I don't have black rose right now but um, what legendary collection 5ds comes out I'm getting one so yeah one quick draw no qu one quick bolt quill bolt uh, this guy is amazing just instantly bring him back to from your grave to the field if you have tuners that way you could just synchro and synchro and then this thing will be banished but it doesn't matter he's still he's still very good um, for a material so yeah you need synchro materials quick draw the thing plant engine spore lone fire and dandy 
Um, <clears throat> Spore, you could, mostly you're going to use it for one for one. Lone Fire, you could use it for Dandy um, or for a Spore, depends. So, yeah. I love the plane engine. Small one, I didn't, I decided not to run two Lone Fires because it just, sometimes I get to draw them both and I'm like, I can't do anything. So, yeah. So, next thing, spell cards, three tuning. Three tunings. Um, very good searcher for either junk synchron and quick draw synchron. You could get unknown synchron, but you want him in the deck most of the time. So yeah. Uh, the only downside is the milling. If you mill well, like level eater, you're good. If you mill something else, it's like ah crap. So yeah. Two MSTs. Um, staples. I don't like running three because clocks the. It clocks the deck too much. Two soul charge. Uh, soul charge is amazing. That's as much I had. I, I don't need to say more about that. Dark hole, book of moon, mind control, foolish burial, and one for one. Those are the four that. Those are the five staples that I say that are really necessary for almost any deck, except for one for one. One for one is for this deck though, but very good card. Oh yeah, and Rhoda. Rota for Junk uh, junk Synchron and Doppel Warrior. So, yeah. So, you have four searchers, I don't know, like in the spell section. And you have the Trap Line. Trap Line is simple. Um, you got Torrential, Your Warning, Bottomless, Compulse, and Phoenix Chain, and Call of the Haunt. <clears throat> uh, I decided not to run Mirror Force because there's a lot of things that stop negating the destruction of stuff. So, I'd rather run. A Phoenix Chain and a Compulse instead of Mirror Force. Um, but aside from that, yeah, I'm good. I think I'm good from the trap. So yeah, extra deck. And here's where you people are going to be salty. Well, some of you. TG Halberd Cannon is my proxy for shooting Quasar. Why? Level 12. Same summoning conditions. 4,000 attack, 4,000 defense. And uh, it's a similar effect. But, you know, Quasar is way better. So yeah. You got Shooting Star Dragon, um, he's amazing. One Stardust Dragon, two Formula Synchron, uh, one Junk Warrior, one Junk Gardener. Reason why Junk Gardener, uh, sometimes if you do not manage to pull stuff or you pull your other level six, um, you could just bring Junk Gardener, stop your opponent from attacking him. He has a pretty good defense and. Um, <clears throat> Yeah, he's a pretty good monster overall. Um, oh, and also Junk Synchron goes very well into him. So yeah. Junk Archer. Uh, why Junk Archer instead of Junk Berserker? Well, I had Junk Archer, so I just decided to run him. And um, his effect's okay. It's just good if you have other monsters. So, Junk Destroyer, amazing card. I love this card. Um, so easy to manage to at least... Uh, at most, you could get like four non-tuners quickly with him and then pop everything in your opponent's side of the field. Turbo Warrior, reason why Turbo Warrior instead of Drill Warrior. Uh, Turbo Warrior, he is very good against little monsters. He's like the big daddy of stuff. Level six or lower monsters cannot target him. So, and synchro, uh, synchro monsters that are, well, when he attacks a synchro monster, uh, its attack is reduced by half. So this guy, 2500 attack, level 6, with that cannot be targeted by little monsters. Very good card. Um, I'd rather run him than Drill Warrior. Drill Warrior is nice because he could attack directly, but he, if he gets targeted, he's done. He he can't do anything. So yeah. Row Warrior for the for the shooting quasar uh, loop. Uh, not loop. First turn shooting quasar. Armory Arm, uh, Armory Arm so good, uh, even it's its own effect so good, um, I think the best level 4 Synchro Monster out there in my opinion, so yeah. TG Librarian instead of Catastor because you're going to Synchro, everything is Synchro Summon, so you're going to be drawing for days sometimes, sometimes you'll be drawing a lot with uh, Librarian. Iron Chain Dragon, why? Because the Breed Dragon. I could have chosen Goyo Guardian, but I don't have a Goyo anymore, unfortunately. 
And yeah, I've been in tears. No, I'm just kidding. That I don't have Goyo Guardian anymore. <laughs> so yeah, Iron Chain Dragon is so good. Um, he The only downside is you're going to mill your opponent five cards. So if your opponent runs, I don't know, Light's Horns, you're dead. Don't run him. He's terrible. Yeah, he's kind of bad, so yeah. And Ancient Pixie, I don't have Black Rose, so I decided to run her. Ancient Pixie Dragon, if your opponent has field, a field spell, this card's very good. If not, just set him in defense. And level eat him. So yeah. But that's the whole deck. Um, got not much to say about it. That I still work in progress. Any suggestions, please comment below. Uh, it's not going to be a tier 1 deck guaranteed for sure. Shadows right now are very good. Lightshorns are good. Anything but this deck is good. This good deck's not really that great. Uh, it's fun. I love it. And I have a blast sometimes playing it. But yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Please subscribe. Thanks for liking this entire video. I hope you guys enjoy my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video.